Yo, what's going on guys? It is Glake back with another Core Reacts for this weekend. Honestly, I was not planning on doing two of these, but hey, this is how things are panning out because uh, I really don't have time to do any longer videos. And uh, two bands that I've been having my eye on lately have uh, both dropped tracks, one of which um, apparently their video is not working or it's, it, I guess it's like privated or something on their YouTube channel. So like I can't really find the official like actual music video for it um if you're curious as to what band that is that is lost in separation um a band that i've i think i've done a reaction for before i did one for one of their 2000 what was it 20 i think it was a 2021 release that they did um when they released i think they released a uh uh chasing apparitions was the uh apparitions was the um the name of the track and the name of the EP that they released in 2021. And um, yeah, I guess they are getting ready to release new music once more. They just dropped a new single, but unfortunately I can't, I can't really do a proper reaction for it because the music video is, it's private or something on YouTube. So I was like, all right, I guess we'll go on to POD. These guys have uh, dropped a new track this weekend as well. And um, I did do POD. I did a reaction to POD recently, rather recently. I think it was like less than 10 uh, core reacts ago. So rather recently, because these guys are probably going to be dropping a new album next year, I think. Um, this is, I think this is like the second single that is probably going to be on the album. This is like the second single they've released for the upcoming album, but I don't think they've officially announced anything yet but i think it's pretty evident that <laughs> there's going to be one coming next year so we're going to check this out today this is featuring tantiana Sh how do i even pronounce that shmeluk shmeluk i'm gonna i definitely butchered that but uh afraid to die very interesting uh, track title. I'm really curious to see what this is all about. The last track, like I said, um, I can't remember the name of it. This is the one, Drop. I felt like this was pretty repetitive, though it was kind of like, it was definitely more of a radio track. I feel like um, it felt a little repetitive, but, you know, it did have some groove. It did have some bounce to it, some punch. But I am really hoping that this one's a little bit more melodic, a little bit more drawn out, and a little bit more creative, I guess you can say. Um, because I know these guys... These guys, they they do that. <laughs> they do that. That that is that is their game. Uh, they can be all over the place if they want to, and they often are. So, really curious to see what this is like. And now uh, we're just gonna hop right into this. Here we go. Oh snap! Oh okay. I was expecting. I don't know why, but I was expecting like something crazy, crazy heavy. Oh man, this brings me back. I'm getting crazy early 2000 vibes from this. Like this, this sounds like old, old POD. Okay. Positive core. <laughs> okay. POD always has like these anthem tracks. This is definitely an anthem track. Oh, okay, we got some screams.
Okay. All right. So, I mean, a little bit, still a little bit repetitive, but this was more, way more lyrically rich, I think, for sure, than Drop. Um, I dig it. I dig it. I think this is more of an anthem track, for sure. And I know P.O.D., like, they are no stranger to anthem tracks. Yeah, so who is Ginger? I, I feel like I have probably have listened to this band before, because... I feel like she's like a what kind of music? It's very I would have to I would have to I would have to check it out again, but if I'm going off the top of my head, aren't they like very like um how do I even describe their sound like very um Oh man, I don't even I don't even know how to describe it like I I yeah, I literally don't even know how to describe it like mythical type music like I don't even know. I don't even know, but like, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I have listened. I have listened to this band before because when I when I heard her start to sing, I was like, okay, pretty sure I've heard her from somewhere, or you know, maybe another vocalist who is kind of similar. Um, but yeah, I, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I've checked out this band like at least a couple times. I've I've probably heard something by them. Um, but yeah, the the beginning of this track, especially really like the beginning here, like maybe the first like 30 seconds or so. I definitely got like early 2000s POD vibes from that. <laughs> I don't know what it was, but like I definitely got the vibes. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm really interested to see what kind of. Oh hey, well, we are no longer the youth of the nation. <laughs> yeah, everybody everybody's old now. <laughs> youth no longer, right? Youth no longer. Um, but yeah, I'm really interested to see like how much of their past sort of sound that they end up incorporating in this new, I guess, supposed upcoming record. Um, Cause like I said, I haven't really listened to much of POD for a very long time. I think the last time I really dove into them, like for real, for real was probably in, I think it was the record they released in 2016. It wasn't 2017. That's for sure. I think it maybe it was 2015 or 2016. Um, which is crazy because at that time I wasn't really even listening to much like any, I wasn't really listening to anything really rock related. I think maybe the, I think one, I think the only few bands I was really listening to around that time was like falling up straight line stitch before they like just disappeared and, uh, seven dust. But other than that, there really wasn't, there really wasn't too many bands I was checking out, but I think POD was, among those few at some point uh during one of those years and that was that was the last time i really heard too much from them until this so until until drop um so yeah i'm really i'm gonna keep my eye out like i said i'm gonna keep my eye out on, on more future singles from this i don't really mind sort of since it's been so long since i've listened to them i don't really mind just checking out every single single they release um up until the album drops so definitely expect another core reacts featuring uh, a new POD track as soon as they release it. Um, because, yeah, I'm curious. I want to see where they go with this. And uh, my mind is open and I'm ready for it. So anyway, that's going to do it for this one. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like on the vid. Let me know what you thought of the track in the comments below. Would love to hear your thoughts. And most importantly, if you haven't done so yet, make sure you hit the sub button. Hit the bell so you can stay up to date with all the latest core reacts going up on the weekends. For you guys here on the channel, don't want you guys to miss out. This is Coriac 61. Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe I've done... It doesn't even feel like I've done more than 30 of these. It doesn't even feel like I've done more than 20. It's hard to believe that I'm on Coriac 61. Kind of crazy. Um, But anyway, that's going to do it for me today. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you for your energy as usual. And I'll catch you guys next weekend for more Coriac. Peace. Rap, 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 rap,